Hey everybody, welcome back. Now we're going to go ahead and take a look at Clone Commander Jet. And this is from the Star Wars Clone Wars Collection. And I'm always excited to get another Clone Commander because they typically have a few more accessories and and pistols. They're they're generally more interesting than your, your run-of-the-mill clone. And um, let's go ahead and take a look at the packaging. There's a nice picture here of him. And... Uh, we have a scene from the Clone Wars and a bio. Clone Commander Jet battles Separatist forces on Geonosis. The gunship carrying Jet, Hiatimundi, and clone troopers is hit by enemy fire and crashes on the planet. On the ground, Jet leads clone troopers into battle against the droid, the droid army and Geonosian warriors, fighting to reach the rest of the Republic invasion force. So, um, we, uh, this is... Uh, a figure from the uh, the battle where Obi Wan was severely wounded, and we had the flamethrower troopers fight, fighting the the Geonosians, and we once again have a figure that has this cool uh, brownish tan armor that goes with the other ones we've had. So, um, if you're an army builder, this is a, a commander to add to those figures, and uh, I think this is just a good figure to own. And I, I'm excited to open it. So let's go ahead and without further ado. Okay, we have his card. Take a look at that. It does come with a stand. A game die to add to my growing collection. I'm going to need the scissors for this one. Okay, let's take a look at this figure. Now, uh, if you are a fan of uh, clone trooper figures that have removable helmets, this one does not have a removable helmet. However, you can take hold on, you can take this part of its helmet off, like an earpiece, and it also comes with an earpiece that has extended antenna. So that's a neat feature. And if you look at the picture on the card. He uh, he does have the extended antenna on that picture. So um, he has two blasters and holsters. And they fit nicely in the holsters. He comes with a uh, rocket firing thing. Uh, I'm not a big fan of these um, rocket firing accessories. I, I prefer just the the blasters and, and the pistols. But either way, this is still a, an exciting figure. Kind of uh, reminds me of Captain Rex if, if he was wearing this sort of desert armor. Just a good figure. Has the articulation we're used to from the clone troopers. Ball joint and neck. Ball hinge shoulders, ball hinge torso, swivel hips, ball hinge knees, and ball hinge ankles, and swivel wrists, and ball hinge elbows. So, uh, great articulation. He has his insignia on his shoulders. And uh, all things considered, this is a, a good figure to add to your collection. If you're uh, wanting to uh, do a diorama of that scene from the Battle of Genosis, this is a must. So I hope you enjoyed this review, so please rate, comment, and subscribe.